All right, everybody, welcome back to some GAC. First 3v3 match of the season, and I think it's going to be a tough one, but an interesting one, the season that is, and also this match. My opponent is Jedi Junior. They're in one of the mall guilds. 14 million GP, 14.39. So that's a massive, massive account. Um, let's do the thing. Let's sort by the bottom. Everything is R7 and above, and only a few R7s at that. We got the bottom of the barrel, like Lobot, Mob Enforcer, and Ugnot. Lando can be used in that speeder bike raid, so he's a little less useless because he's good in the raid, but still one of the unlucky R7s. Man, he is neglected. Um, so plenty of set 13s and plenty of set 14s. So he's he's locked and loaded. He has everything um i guess i should show the mod comparison too we got it pulled up here and zoomed in uh so 60 more zetas 20 more omicrons 800 more relic tier totals double the more than double the six dot mods insane top speed this is a serious player this is a serious account so <clears throat> Definitely an uphill battle, um, but let's have fun with it. It's the first one. I have limited intel on all these two Datacrons, so I'll just do the best I can. Up top, I'll show my defenses too. I had to reset them a lot because the last 3v3 match of last season was where it was all light side, dark side I did with a guide, so I had to completely revamp that. We got Malgus up here along with Zori. I don't know why you run Jai Training Ray and Zori because it turns off a lot of her kit because she's an Ufu, but... Could be good, I guess. Sana and Hondo, Darth Revan, uh, Malik, and Alan. So I don't know where Basla. Oh, Basla's up there. Duh. Um, Tuscan's got both the Omicrons. This one, the leadership is useless, but Tuscan Raider is good. So no GLs there. Um, and no GLs on the bottom that I see either. So we'll see. Darth Muff Gideon was a menace last season. Still going to be really hard. My plan is Malgus there. Got Star Killer. <laughs> we have Gas with Krex and Fives. My plan is Star Killer, but that deflection feels like a lot worse than 22%, I'm sure. Gorgon Jin and Keller and Beck Omi, or Datacron, but Keller and Beck is not in the lead, so I am afraid of that. I'm going to use JML. I'm not going to mess with it. Like, I don't know what. Like, this is going to be crazy. I mean, it has a plus 100% offense, so I don't feel confident unless I take out Anakin first. And then to have the Omicron turned off, because that, that's going to be crazy. Um, and then we got Saw, probably just going to bane that. And then General Grievous with uh, with Stab, with the Omicron. And normally people don't like setting General Grievous in 3v3, because it's really wampable. However, this makes me worried about that, and probably not going to do that, because... They don't, didn't give the target lock one, they gave the one that I, I said would recommend for trench. It's pretty much designed for trench. Because it does give her a post. Uh, and this guy's going to be countering all the time and hitting under one for his protection. Um, or he's going to be assisting all the time. And yeah, don't really want that. So I might try Night Sisters there. However, let's just start out with. Let's let's do a tune up. Let's just do Bane and Bane versus this. Because. Should be easier. That's what we're looking for. So Bane and someone here. I do have Savage for offense. Um, I I have Watt on defense, so oh, if Sith Eternal, maybe I should do Sith Eternal on Gas instead, and then just use Set. I might do that. Set better for banners. Uh, I got two of these, so might as well. <coughs> Use one. Oh, the protection up might help too. That's a decent thing as well. Eh. I'll just do this. Okay. Eh. All right. Oh, let's do it. The easy win first and jump into more but ones like that hit him bing bang boom get out of here 68 
Okay, now Darcher <laughs> Mop Gideon. Uh, this is a little bit more of a known entity. Um, I'll have Malak for somewhere else. So the question is, do you use a Sith Datacron or do I do Doubt? Doubt does help, but this, ignore Taunt, that's good. I think I'll do this. I'll try this. Now, protect, protection up will help as well. Uh, also, <clears throat> also, just so you know, I feel really crappy today. I haven't been crappy since yesterday. Hopefully, doing Grand Arena makes me feel a little bit better throughout, but not feeling great. Okay, come on, guys. Please. Please. Donk. Why I need to control that dark trooper crap. Good. I am not liking this. Oh shoot! Oh gosh! They made that dark trooper like insane again. Like they they nerfed him, and, and then they brought it back, and it wasn't as good. And now that's it. Completely insane. What the heck is that? What the crap was that? That was absolutely unhinged. That was not multiple hits from the Dark Trooper. <laughs> that was a single hit for 200,000. So if they got all the hits in there, five or six, that's over a million damage. That seems balanced to me. Yeah, sure. Sure. Seems pretty balanced. So I'm going to have to use like JML or something, JMK or something like that. Ah. That sucks. Stupid. That is. So I'm gonna try Night Sisters here. Let's see. Want that one for DP March Aid. Okay, let's see how this works. Stamp when I was going over my squad recommendations because Okay for a second I was like is there a revive prevention mechanic here that I didn't realize and I was terrified I wanted to bring Talzin back, but they just melted at the thought of Night Sisters. I should have gone in a Clone Wars show. Um. So, the question, like, now that I'm gonna have to burn another GL up top, I can't use C. I don't think C is gonna handle that type of pressure from Dark True Moff Gideon. I might just have to go back to Starkiller here, because C would be more useful. 
and something else back potentially. Uh, so let's do Star Killer. Um, but I. This is gonna be kind of worrisome. Well, 100% last season, and we have last season data crons. Oh, hopefully it works. It's probably the best possible value for Star Killer. But it is worrisome. I can kill Krex even when gas is up, so that's something to keep in mind. Get that stagger. Uh, give me some stun, snow. Should get to our Star Destroyer pretty... Not too... Be too bad. Um... Yeah, hit that... Dagger. That's yeah, gonna be so hard to kill five. FC is so janky. Maybe all Star Destroyer. For the protection. No. No. I'll take out corrects, but he... Um, just the health. Man, he's got so much defense. What is that? That's insane. Yeah, I gotta go bricks first. Okay. There. Okay, good. Just a single target attack. Shock to prevent the turn meter. He can get crit because he didn't have a full fiber first team. Stun was then supposed to crit. It. Dispelled immediately. On. Oh, yeah, and he doesn't. He's not super. He doesn't have the other benefits like extra turn meter because it was not full fiber first. But that was good. 56. That worked out well. Um, now we gotta use our two GLs for the front. So I'll just do JML and Oda, I guess. Um, I, I had a good like protection crom, but I'm actually kind of glad now I put it on defense with Qui-Gon because I have Key Eddie Moody and I'm just doing some overkill crap here, so. Uh, get a little protection. That could be valuable. I'm gonna save that. The revive prevention. I'll just use a. I want to say a weak level. Dang, I I forgot how few data crowns I'm gonna be working with since I lost all this at twelve. Good, but I don't want to use nothing. I, I should use basically nothing, actually. <laughs> Got Anakin, and take the fight on. And... Guys.
I got let's try to take that. It's it has so much protection. Actually let me take out Qui-Gon, because it'll just take forever. To get Kellarm back. Crap, man. Get this song. Yoka. A concerning amount of damage. Okay. I <laughs> think he's got like no health in comparison. Okay, so Dark Trooper Mop Gideon. Oh, I had this zoomed in. That was a percentage last time. Our Kylo is also kind of like that. I think I'll just do JMK Cat. <gasps> They're so valuable, right? Yeah, I just, I don't want to mess with it, it's something to come back and be in the butt. Faster they actually... Oh, I have more danger of being like, lap. I have 362, no, I should go. Actually, I, I don't feel safe. I want to tank. <laughs> um, I want to save GK for a Bastila team, but I'll use... Himself there, but I don't think it's gonna matter much. Ooh. Defense up, that's it. It's in the back. Kinda hope he cheats me so I don't stuck. BL City. Surprise. Only four of them. Um problematic. MK's as for that, I'll probably do Kylo there. Uh, for that, I don't know. Raise a pain. That one. Hard. Yeah. Yeah, I probably screwed <laughs> screwed here. Uh, but let's plan around all of this. All right, coming back in. We're gonna start with the top. Um, because I want to make sure I get to ships at least. I've seen this movie play out where I try to take care of the big stuff on the bottom and then it's stuck. So, hoping to avoid that. Um, Bastila, Cal. And just some kind of protection. Up, Kron. Sure. Uh, set my Lord Vera on defense, hoping that they just set Bo on defense. Because I did not been putting Lord Vera on defense, and maybe they'd be quick to put no, no dice. Let's 
Dang, they're like eating through Bastila. Oh, good, she got stunned. Because my Bastila's going down. Uh, she's in damage. I'll leave that. Take him. Hang in there, Bastila. Don't let it, that imposter over there get to you. Jeez, this is like... Not a crazy... Covering protection. I don't want to stall. No, I can't stall. Get 55. Uh, Tuskins. I'm gonna do Treya. Yeah, I don't think Treya can do anything. My pro big problem right now, I think, is Ray. I don't know if I can kill the Ray. I think the Ray will be the last thing left. I'm gonna try set the turtle for it, but that's that seems like such a long shot. I need more data crons. Like it, I can't farm enough data crons right away. All right, Tuskins. Wait a bit. Yeah, let's wait for that and then reset the cool press. Try this one. a little nervous when that hit comes because I'm like I should be able to tank the whole thing but you never know come on let me don't go on it's healing up noxious as crap ha <laughs> Out of here, you deserve it. Mm -hmm. 
Silas. Um, here I'm gonna use CLS. No dash this time, I'm just gonna do CLS, Han, and Chewy. Um, with tenacity. <sighs> Come on, guys. To resist that crap. Get the heck out of here. And the longest time since I used these three together in 3v3. Gotta hit Sana now? Unfit? Well, not great banners, but does anyone still think I'm gonna win this? Um, I want to use Afra for Darth Revan. Afra would be probably fine here, but I'm gonna use Jedi. They are getting. Everyone's gonna fall under once. Maybe. Gotta use Jedi Luke lead there. The uh, Darth Revan is a concern. So. Yeah, okay, Cal. Don't have me. I think I have mace on defense. So I could run like Dina, Luke, Harris, an old banner, or something like. Don't see it. I, I think I might have to do Afra here just because of that, like, everyone has to go under health. Because I need big AoE power. Um, I'm just gonna do that for here. I just want to mess with it, even though this might fail. Afra is not what she used to be last season. See, he can't die because everyone else has to go under, but now he did. The Zori is gone. A lot of the Zori's kits neutralized by just having an Ufu over there. Okay. Easy enough. Um, and now Jedi. Unconventional because Jedi Luke's lead is turned off for a lot of them, but I think I need to go that. Uh, my prevention probably not doing anything, so I just gotta go with the boost. A deflection. 
I have this, but if Bo-Katan Mandalore never comes back, then I can't like make use of it. So I'd have to swap turn to Luke. I think this will fail. But I don't have these guys slotted for anything in the back, otherwise I'm gonna have to use like a GL or something. One hang in there, Luke. Okay, good. good. Fall under half health, Revan. Okay. No, not death mark. No, the death mark has come back. Watch Oli. It's Jolie, yes. I just want to increase his cooldowns. Oh my gosh, you guys are killing me over here. Done now, good guy. Gotta stick the landing. Man, I cannot believe how many death marks I got through with JKL. Oh my gosh, that's one of my favorite battles in a long time. That was... Oh, that was all grit. That was crazy. Good job, JKL. Man. Revan and Jolie. It's been the longest time since Jolie was actually clutched like that. That was Okay, Executor, Negotiator, and Malevolence, so probably Profundity, Leviathan. Dang, that was great. Unplugged. Right now for these Titans. I was trying to say time to face these Titans on the bottom, but the recording cut off too soon. Um, but... I, I filtered back for season 45 for what Java was like, so that was the last season, last 3v3 season we had before the Bushcron. That's that's an interesting thing. I, I don't think everyone thinks about that or has tried that, but like in Swigadai GG, it only goes back three seasons. Uh, so uh, 49 was the only 3v3 season that you can click on through this. But if you go up here in the link, you just pick the season you want. You can go back pretty far to like 20s or 30s or something. Uh, but yeah, so Supreme Lord Kylo with, um, I think I'm going to do Hux and First Horse Stormtrooper. I don't have crew. I have crew on defense because uh, otherwise it's it's a lot. It was a lot lower with Bushkron. So Hux, First Horse Stormtrooper, um, get some doubt out up in here as always. Um... Sure, tenacity sounds good. Yeah, R9 across the board over there. Oh, they just have survivability for Boosh. I would 
be more scared of doubt, but that's... I guess she's... She's the key, so... Undoubtedly a terrible banner battle, but I mean it is, but I'm just wondering if first door stormtrooper will stay alive or not. Siphoning away, siphoning away, and little Java in the process. All right, big guys down. Um, so Leia, I have to do Java still, but I am not convinced. Like it's pretty much my only choice. Oh, um. I still gotta do doubt. Let's see. I could, my stats are like crap on all these. Like they're not concentrated at all. I barely did any rerolls. Um uh, so Drogan I'm scared of. I don't I don't think this is even gonna go. It's like with the Ushkron, I want to kill Rogan as fast as possible. Oh, Ben's gonna taunt, but I still think I have to do all this. Rogan. He didn't taunt. That was, that was his, his uh, mistake. Buff immunity there. It's on him. I want buff immunity over here now. Oh no. Oh, wow. Ah. I think that, um. No, stop. Oh gosh, dang you. I think the thing was to was to think. Yeah, this is. I don't think I'll get that. Works for me. Definitely a feeler match. You. I oh, know I don't want that. For, I'll use the other one for Jin because I want them to get crit when I do Iden. Um. So this was like. My plan was, um, 
I don't know what to do for Leia now. That's something I'm gonna have to figure out. Go back to the drawing board on. Uh, some damage Each time Doubt, so that wouldn't really matter. I think I'm gonna need an ultimate to actually kill. It's not getting enough damage. still a problem. 3-3 three, three are still really strong. Um, Uranus here. Although this could definitely like Didn't want the massive amount of crit avoid because uh, I'm gonna need crits on them to kill them. The other Jin, Victron had so much. It's already hard with these tanks. These tanks are high. Protection, low health, super durable. But after we get the alt, we can potentially just kill Aiden. As long as I keep that off. So I got the buff. And what what was that? Like nothing happened. Basically nothing happened. Yeah, this is gonna be bad. Things. Okay, he didn't have the right buff, so she stayed alive. Oh. Can't get it back, it's doubt. Well you have the buff, so you can kill him. Okay. Good. I'm gonna use that yet because I can't get it on anyone without. Okay, I can. Oops. Okay, but it's, it's coming along. It's coming along. 
One lonely. I didn't. I, I, I just finished watching Stargate Atlantis. I don't know how many people watched that show, but there was one episode where there was this female team of like strike, like a female strike team they met up with on this planet, and one of them looked exactly like Aiden Rocio. That was like mid 2000s. So I was like, did they base her on this chick? I don't know. I doubt anyone has any idea what that is. What episode I'd be referring to. 56? Okay, that worked. And we're gonna be stuck with these lovely ladies. Oh, I didn't set Hondo anywhere? <laughs> I meant to set Hondo somewhere. Ah, uh, should put him with Dash or something. Yeah, uh, well, I guess Malik makes sense. Um, and then... Last out. Oh, I got left. I got Darth Vader. I got Imperial Troopers. No use for Imperial Troopers right now. Bounty Hunters, Hondo, Bad Batch. I hate the. I can't even use Bad Batch anymore anywhere. It's just like. Perfect. Stuff. Probably four turns. Okay. Malak lasted as long as any other. Ain't gonna be there. R9 Malak doesn't matter. And I don't think I have enough. Like, this shared health thing is a huge pro- like, I know C isn't the optimal choice anyway, but it's a huge problem for someone like C. Oh, cool. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna cycle through it, cycle through our turns, try to get rid of the healing immunity. Heal up. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh stupid redeemed okra. I thought I get to pop it. Mm. All right. Well, that yeah. No getting by those. So for those that wanted the end of the efficiency meta, it's I don't know if it's here, but for me it might be here. So we'll see. And to finish it off now with ships, profundity verse executor. Miss. Oh, are you kidding me? Get out of here. Wait. Falcon gonna do the wiggle, he's gonna get annihilated. I'm glad the daze is there.
Cassian. Take him out. Wanna miss. The ultimate. No, don't kill him! <laughs> crap but I, t I didn't clear so it's not like I'm in a arms race of banners way r9 r8 r8 r9 r9 solid that's massive I knew this bracket was gonna be rough. I'm like pretty high ranked. I'll, I'll look at that in a second. So insane. Oh. I have done the assist instead. I feel like that might be something I should have done. Um, I need a brain. I need a medic. Hmm. Real. gonna be wasted, right? I can't do the insta-kill right now. Oh good, hit, hit the mark six head. This fleet, man, okay, well. Oh, capital ship acquired, but jeez. Only target this. Good. I don't have a uh, Emperor Shuttle anymore. This is why I tell people every roster of you, you work on this fleet negotiator. Like, is it good? Like, someone was like, is this, is it good enough? Like, is it worth working on? Like, Babbage takes Chirotech. Is it, is it good? Is it a good fleet? Is it worth it? Yes. Yes, it is. 
I'm using the best fleet in the game and having an extreme trouble. 66. And the last one, Chimera. Here goes nothing. I want all those dodges. Oh, wow, this one is really going smooth. Get the insta kill. Or the. Oh, uh, you're not topped off. Turn meter to the malevolence, but choice. Oh, good, it wasn't an AoE. That was pretty dang smooth. So, yeah, full health and protection for everyone. That was perfect. 74. Okay, well, 1657. Um, I got I got some girl trouble right now. Um, what I have on defense. Rex, or Rex Rex 5, Starter Mock Gideon, Holdo Datacron, I don't even have the Ray Datacron, I don't have a ton. Keller and Beck, uh, but Root. In the back, I put Lord Vader. Um, probably would just get eaten alive by Bo. I was hoping Bo would be on defense. Uh, Qui Gon with that cam thing. Gas up top, trench with Watt, bam with the new Mandalorians I have, and then Malakos. I'd have to go back to Slicker Malakos. Because I'm not sure what to do with Slayer. Like, and this is the first season where I was like, yeah, we don't need that anymore. Um, yeah, and then got Holdo, defense. For the, for the longest time, I finished comeuppance, or like two days, and I just didn't upgrade it. I just never went to that screen to upgrade it, because I never have need on this account to go to that screen. So it was, it was kind of funny. Um, as far as rank, I'll show you where I'm at. It says nominally that I'm... 80? But there's all these fake accounts. Not fake accounts, but like it shouldn't be. 103? But there's all these accounts at the top that are just like the people that don't belong there still. Like they still haven't fixed this. I don't know how many are there, but I think there's dozens. Uh, I'm just looking at the guilds. Okay, nice name. Like this guy's in Call Patrol, so he probably belongs there. Almost 15 million GP. You order 66. Yeah, five million. So. And it doesn't stop there. Like, there are dozens of them. So I might be... I might be top 50, like, for, like, people actually there. So it's no surprise that I have a Nightmare Bracket. Just to look at the overall bracket. Uh, 14 million, 12. So these guys are kind of normal. Oh, I have one of the... <laughs> Well, I don't think I'll go 0 in 3, because if we get to the end, I'll get relief against that guy. But I don't want that, because it's boring. 13 million. I played this guy before. Mini Zelandis Gosilar. Name. Um, Candy Jedi. I know I've played her before. And Toki Hajime. I've played him before. 
Yeah, so it's a tough bracket. We'll see what the heck this guy does, but I, I think I'm toast for this match. And now for the results. I uh, got his attacks in. And of course cleared. But 1930. This is not this is not 5v5. You get a much higher score base in this and 3v3 Grand Rain. So where do you, where do you do the drops? Okay, not on the front. Uh, he navigated that pretty well. The back got several drops. Three battles for Tuskins, two on Lord Vader, and two on Zori. That's not all on the top as well. We had three battles on the BAM team and then two on Seer Malico. So that is a pretty successful defense. Um, if I clean these guys, if I, I clear up these two, or, which is a big if, uh, then I win, like, regardless. Like, it's not like I need it to be clean or anything. Um, I've been I've been hearing Bane is the answer for Ray. I don't know if that holds up completely. That would be great. I might need to start saving Bane for Ray. Uh, I mean, that would be fantastic if it does work easily. Then for Leia, I might have to do Slicker Malikos again. Which is unfortunate. Uh, I did. And then hopefully I can save JMK for Java, but then it's like, what do I do for freaking Dark Room off Gideon? Like, if Malgus. Maybe I just needed a Dalkron. I don't know. Um, instead, but Malgus really ate it there. Just so tough. Starkiller is great for Sakas. Really overkilled there, but I. Uh, that would be scary. And then I don't know what to do there. Maybe Seth the Eternal Emperor works there? I don't, I'm not sure. I, I need some extras in there to stay alive at least. Uh, but I mean, this getting my feet wet for this season. It's going to be an interesting one. Uh, so yeah, and this was, there's no shame to me in losing this player's very huge account. Anyway, thanks for watching guys and see you in the next one.